Hey guys, it's Andy. I'm back here for uh, more Skyrim. Um, this is actually probably going to end up being... <laughs> I want to call it like a lost episode or something, because I don't know if this will ever get uh, published or not. Because uh, this is more of a test. Like, I'm, I'm testing stuff to see... Uh, you know, some settings to determine... Uh, you know, to try to get better with... Uh, the problems I was having, you know, with the corruption and whatnot, so, uh, I don't have 5k bear pelts, but, uh, I wanted to, um, I wanted to just go through a dungeon, because dungeons are usually filled with, uh, fighting, and that's where, uh, you know, the, the corruption comes from, I think, uh, sp specifically fire fights, because, you know, I, I'm, uh, fire bolting a lot during these, uh, these battles, so... But, but here, as you can see, I'm just going through my house. I'm, uh, un unloading my stuff. I was pretty encumbered, so... I do this. I, I guess I can check my, uh, my stuff. Just, this is my, my chest of weapons. Every playthrough, I always make sure this chest has my weapons in it. Weapons I just feel like keeping. I, I'm of course not using weapons this playthrough, but I still like uh, keeping some of this stuff. Yeah, I, I, I don't know why I'm showing this, but uh, a lot of staves apparently. More than I uh, realized I had. But now I'll just uh, put away these. I'm saving, like, all the boots and gloves I can find. As well as, you know, hats and stuff. Anything that, uh... Do I have a ring? Yes, I do. Anything that, um... That I can enchant without, uh, armor, you know. And here's where I put my books. Um, I got some... Some, uh... Like, skill... Skill books that I haven't used yet. I got these from the, uh... College of Winterhold questline. I haven't read them. Just saving them till I'm a uh, higher level, so I get more more out of it. Uh, those are the ones, and then do I have anything else? 93. That looks about right. So what do you need? My now, friend? hey Lydia, what you got going on? What you reading? Beggar print, oh, Lydia. Aside from that, I got a bunch of these quests. Um, for for the playthrough, I wanted to show this, this of course, this this uh, and this but this is a, actually a, like a dungeon so there's probably gonna be fighting so I didn't want to do this but since this is a test episode I'm just gonna go ahead and do it anyway it's actually daytime in white run now which is so rare for me it's usually always nighttime here so all the shops are closed I should probably sell my stuff instead of doing this dungeon but uh, I'm in, I'm in the mood to, uh, to fight some stuff right now. Where am I supposed to... Okay, this way. What's this? L lil... Lit? <laughs> Ill? <laughs> I don't know what this is. Anyway, this is Azura's quest. Um, my character is, of course, Dunmer. Who, uh... They're known to renown uh, Azura, so... I definitely wanted to do this quest for the channel, but... Uh, like I said, I'm not... Not sure about all the, uh... Done, like dwelling and fighting so uh look at look at this area though very very nice nice and scenic just going like in in this what, what even it's like a collapsed underwater tower let's go i don't even know what's in here i'm probably gonna die extensively but uh all right yeah let's go Okay, definitely got the, uh, the water aspect, uh, you know, for sure. Got this skeleton, too, okay. I guess I could, uh, show what the quest is about. Since, well, I guess it's not gonna give me a description. Uh, I talked to some people, and I'm supposed to find Azura's Star, which is an item, a Daedric artifact that will, uh, help my uh, enchanting so uh, 
basically we're just looking for Azura's star in this uh, underwater collapsed uh, tower. What could go wrong? All these bones everywhere. Oh uh, yeah. Is that a skeleton? Yes it is. What do I got equipped? Fast healing, oh no. I, I should uh should probably do this and this. Oh gosh, it's a mage. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, it's just a novice. Okay. Oh, there went the skeleton. And there went the uh, conjure. Check everything. Usually take some books if I'm not sure if I have them or not, because I like to be like a rag grow shub and collect all the books in the game. Talos mistake. Take that. Gallerian the mystic. Yellow book of riddles. Okay. Darkest darkness. Don't believe I have that one. City of stone. Hey, that's Markarth. We were just there. Disaster and Eonith. Take that too. Human heart? Oh boy. I'm getting into some stuff here. Minor magicka? Come on, that was... That's like... That's like... <laughs> a core... Way less than a core. That's like... It's like a sliver of my... Magicka meter. Oh, okay, we got enemies. Uh, let me just... Here we go. Get you out of the way. Oh, oh no! Oh boy, I messed up, maybe. Alright, we're good. Is this one barred? No. Uh I I'll I'll wait to go there, actually. Let me check uh this way I guess. Oh, there's nothing here, okay, that's why. Sack of flour. What would I do with that? Water breathing? Okay. Alright, so nothing in here. And we were supposed to go, uh, this way. I see someone. Okay. Well. A death. Why? Why am I not? Okay. Uh. Well. I need help. So. Just uh, do this, and then get back to shooting lightning bolts. Alright. Not too bad. That, uh, I wasn't, hey, hey, I'm stuck, hey, thank you, can't even see, need some candlelight.
a lot of bones it looks like maybe I would have been better off not seeing okay oh boy oh boy Uh, that guy take care of that. Man, really thought he'd run up with a dagger. <laughs> Oh, gotta... Really? Just gonna... Just gonna walk away as soon as you get in sight? Bro. Oh, that's a bandit? Why did that nearly kill me? Hey, take care of that for me, will you? Now there's two of them. Okay, there is definitely arrows. Now there's three of them. No, there's only two. Okay. Need another one. And I'll just do this while I'm at it. Oh wait, no, no, there's I guess he didn't die. But now he made the mistake of actually getting in range of me, so Why am I doing no damage? What is happening? Master Necromancer. This is real, ladies and gentlemen. Master Necromancer. Where did you come from? Bro, I'm not doing any damage. Right out, right on me, right on me. I've never seen someone run up that quick, know exactly where to aim, and fire off perfectly before. No, you're going down now. Why are, like every other hit is doing nothing. Get out of here. Oh. Bro, I've never seen a battle like that. Like, I'm level 28. Why am I fighting a master necromancer just randomly in the middle of a dungeon? 
Unless this is the end of the dungeon, which I highly doubt. Extra magicka. I'll take these, I guess. I might need them. Another soul gem. Okay. More extra magicka. Okay. Now what's this? This looks like the end of the... Oh! I guess this was the end. Take the greater soul gem. Search the skeleton. First nice six gold. Uh, is this... Is this what I'm looking for? Flame suppression. This isn't actually the end, is it? What did that do? Oh, that just... Okay. Not sure what the point of that is, but okay. Uh, I do not feel safe walking this way. What's this? An unlock of wooden door, okay. Nice way to break the tension, I suppose. Anything? Minor healing. Okay. Of a door bar. Okay, it says there's something right in there. Another dungeon. Okay. It's been a while since I've done this, so I, I don't know. Like what? Okay, I see someone right there. Who's talking? Sacrifice another disciple. Apprentice Erlen will be no great waste. Yes, still do. Are these enemies? They would have to be. Let me just a uh, quick save in case they're not. Kill them both! Shout out to Chain Lightning. Ah. What do they got? The Doors of Oblivion. Will this increase conjuration? It looks like it did, but I apparently already read that book. Soul Gem Fragment. I'm not taking that. So many so Look at all these fragments. What's this way? Okay, what, uh, okay. Probably just a, uh, yeah. Supply room, okay, I'll take these. All these books, too. Oh, yeah. Ooh, extreme healing, let's go. Guys, never gonna see it coming. Well, how that? How how do he dodge? How do how do he do it? <laughs> Did I? I got that nice arrow in my eye. 
Ah, but that skeleton is long gone. What's in here? Anything? Not that I can tell. What about here? No. Here? No. What's the point of all these? Why are some of them locked? I guess lock picking experience, but like why? Don't get it. Okay. Now that right there seems like the big guy. Like the big guy, you know? So. Let me just uh, creep up real quiet like. I don't have enough mag- okay, I, I messed up badly. I messed up horribly. Good lord. Let's see if I can salvage this. Probably not, because this guy apparently has that spell that I didn't think anyone other than that one guy had, but we're not going to spoil that, so, uh... Still enemies? Still got enemies. Bro, get out here. Oh. I guess no more enemies, actually. That wasn't even the big guy. Like, what? I don't... What is this? I didn't even... That was dangerous right there. Just drowned. Anyway, uh... Where, where'd you go? Okay. One glass dagger and a black soul gem. I should probably be soul trapping some of these people because I have about three soul gems on me right now. Okay, keep in mind, do not use the <laughs> the uh, big spell when uh, like in succession because I don't have that much magicka to uh, use. Right in there, huh? Okay. Oh, wait. Are we actually done this time? Like, for real? I, I don't I don't trust these bones. I'm gonna take their gold before they uh, turn on me. Bandit? What's this? Malin Varen's Grimoire. This is Mail and Baron. I'll take your gold too. There's the star. Here's a bit, just a random bandit. Take that armor. What's in here? Another dagger. More soul gems. Ring of mending. There's a th an effect I don't have. Huh. And another staff of flames. I don't need that. There's the star. 
bring it to Arania or bring it to Nelikar. Arania is a fellow Dunmer who started this quest for me. Uh, Nelithar, or whatever the other one was, is a, uh, a high elf that doesn't trust the Daedra. Uh, ironically, Azura is one of the only Daedra that probably should be trusted. So, uh, it's ironic that he would say that in a quest like this, but, uh, we're going with, uh, what's her name? Because my character is a supporter of, uh, Azura, so we're gonna get Azura's star. So, I'm just gonna exit to Skyrim. See where this puts me? Oh, now we're on top of here. I see that mud crab down there creeping. I think it's a mud crab. I don't know what it is. I bet, yeah, it's a mud crab. That's probably gonna prevent me from fast traveling, I bet. <laughs> All right, so here we are. Uh, we are near uh, the College of Winterhold, actually. We're at a place uh, known as the Shrine of Azura. This is where uh, I found the lady that gave me this uh, quest initially. Here she is. That reveals our true future. Azura Star! I knew the Lady of Twilight had sent you for a reason. Hand it over to me. I will ask Azura to restore the star to its original purity. Alright. I will commune with Azura. She wishes to speak to you herself. Please, place your hands on the altar, and you will hear her voice. Okay. Greetings, mortal. You have followed my guidance through the veils of twilight and rescued my star from Malin Varen. Malin Varen? But his soul still resides within, protected by his enchantments. Until he is purged, my artifact is useless to you. Is there any way... Eventually, the star will fade back into my realm in oblivion. But I doubt you have the hundred or so years it would take to wait. Hmm. No, only one option remains. I will send you inside the star. You will banish Malin's oh, soul boy. there. Tell me when you are ready, mortal. <laughs> uh, I guess I'm ready. Have faith, mortal. I will be watching over you. Okay. Ah, my disciples have sent me a fresh soul. Good. I was getting... hungry. Why? There's something different about you. You can't escape your fate, Malin. This experiment is over. And who are you to challenge me? I have conquered mortality itself. I'm Elegy, Azura's champion. This is my realm now. I've sacrificed too much to let you take it from me. Okay, uh... Okay, I'm just going to... debate that real quick. Then this. And then I'm going to... quick save. This guy loves to summon... Uh, oh, oh gosh, it's happening already. Uh, where, where are you? Lightning bolt. <laughs> okay, this is not working. Extreme healing, 150. I don't need that much. Vigorous? Magica, okay. How much does that heal? Not a whole lot. Okay. 
by itself. Don't worry. Okay, th you thanks, are Isra. <laughs> I'm like about to die, so uh, that is heavily appreciated. If you could uh, hurry up before this thing kills me, though, that'd be much better. Isra, Isra, please. My star has been restored, and Malin's soul has been consigned to oblivion. You have done well, mortal. Ah. Uh. As was destined, you are free to use my star as you see fit. Ah. Uh. Farewell, mortal. Know that Azura will be guarding over the threads of your fate in the twilight. All right. real quick because I am While dying let me star, tell you Azura gave me a vision hey her last she said I have never been without Azura's foresight since escaping Morrowind I don't know what to do if you need me I'd be honored to accompany you guardian of the star it would give me a purpose until next time So I just realized I never really did an outro, so I, I mean, I, I never, like, even looked at my, my newly acquired Azura's Star. Here it is, looking, uh, pretty nice. Oh, uh, yeah. But, yep, that's been, uh, today's episode. Uh, I originally thought this would be, like, a... A lost episode because I didn't expect this to actually turn out nice but uh, it seems as if everything worked so this is just gonna end up being a like 40 minute episode which will be you know hopefully you guys won't mind I mean if you're watching this this, this far you obviously didn't mind but yep that's been this episode for today look forward to next time when we do some more cool stuff <laughs>